Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to show you how to downgrade your iPhone 4S or iPad 2 from 5.1.1 to 5.0.1 and this will allow you to get an untethered jailbreak on your device. Now, one of the, the biggest major prerequisite is you have to have your SHSH blob saved on your device. Now, if you don't remember doing this, if you've jailbroken on 5.0.1 Cydia will automatically do it before, so if you've ever been jailbroken on 5.0.1, you probably have your blobs. Secondly, if you use Tiny Umbrella or anything like that, then in that case, you have your blobs as well. So once you do that, I'm going to be showing you how to do this. So first, you're going to open up Red Snow. You can download this link in the description. Uh, I'll have a link to the post where you can download all the firmwares and red snow that you need for this tutorial. So you're going to hit extras, then you're going to hit even more, and then you're going to hit restore. And when you hit restore, you're going to select the IPSW to be restored. And in this case, you're going to want the 5.0.1 uh, firmware. So you're going to hit open, and it's going to say it needs an additional one so you're going to give it the 5.1.1 for your device now you can download both these notice that this is an iPhone 4S so I'm using the iPhone 4S one so once you give it those two uh, it says that your base panel will be updated and this is only relevant if you need to unlock your phone which most people don't so we're going to hit next but if you or yes but if you do want to unlock your phone and you've been preserving your base pan then don't do this now the device will go into recovery mode and so the next thing you're going to do is hit remote if you have it on Cydia and then local if you have your blob stored locally so I've used Cydia in the past so I'm just going to be hitting remote and it's going to fetch the blobs from the server and once it does that and loads up everything it needs to it will begin to uh, downgrade your device Now Red Snow might say it failed or might say it succeeded. If it did succeed, and even in my case it said it failed, uh, your device will have restored. And as you can see right here, my device is on 5.0.1, and I just have it down here so it doesn't show my number. Anyways, uh, just a quick video. Now once you're here, you can jailbreak untethered using the jailbreak tutorial in the description if you like the jailbreak. Anyways, hope this worked out for you guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.